Hey there, everyone. How are you doing? How was school today? Did you have lots of homework? Have you been good? Have you been reading lots of books on your own? Well, today we have "me want pet" words by Tammy Saver, pictures by Bob Shea. Want to find out what "me want pet" is about? Let's have a look. Me want pet. Cave boy had lots of things: rocks, sticks, a club, but no pet. Me sad," said cave boy. "Want pet?" That's something I hear all the time in my house. Cave boy went to find one. He searched near and far until. A woolly mammoth. Cave boy rode woolly home. He looks quite cozy, doesn't he? Me want pet. Ugh! Come on, the mama. He too big. Where he sleep? Cave boy gave woolly a hug. Me wish you could stay, pal. Then cave boy tried again. He searched high. And low until a saber-toothed tiger, cave boy, and toothy raced home. Me want pet, a chuga, sneezed Papa. Make me sneeze, no can't stay. Cave boy and toothy sigh. Me sorry, buddy. Oh. But Cave Boy did not give up. He searched across grasslands, over seas, and through forests. Uga, a baby dodo bird. Poor baby," said Cave Boy. "No mama anywhere." Wah wah. No too big. No sneeze. Me want pet. Ah. <gasps> Grunted Gran, no can keep. He no potty train. Cave boy groaned and turned to Dodo. Me so sad. Just then, the ground shook. Stampede! Yelled Mama. What we do? Called Papa. We take cover! Hollered Gran. Ga ga. Dodo. No, cave boy to the rescue! With a little help from his friends, Fuga cheered the family. Cave boy had lots of things: rocks, sticks, a club, but cave boy did not have one pet. Cave boy had three. Oog, and that was B one pet. Such a cute book, right? I love it. Hope you like it as much as I did. And if you did, do give us a like and subscribe, and click on the bell if you want more stories like this. If you like a copy of this book, the links are in the description below. You take care now, and remember to read lots of books on your own. We'll see you back here soon. Bye bye.